heavyweight boxing fans, what's the deal? All right, so I was on ringposka.pl uh, yesterday, and I seen this article, so I put it in Google Translate, and you know, sometimes it all it isn't uh, always a hundred percent of the translation, but from what I can read, Arthur Spilka had staph infection, and there was a fight between him and Christoph Zimnock that was uh, being talked about for December second. Right now, everything is on hold. I'm not sure if that fight will still go forward this year. But uh, Spilka right now is taking antibiotics and he is trying to heal from this and uh, overcome this problem. Um, and they're trying to get that Zimnock fight. So I guess we'll have to see and you know wait and see what's going to actually happen. But right now they're reporting that he does have staph infection. And he and Zimnock, uh, you guys go on the internet, man. You go on uh, YouTube and type uh, Spilka Zimnock in the search box and you'll see videos of these guys going at it. Uh, Spilka actually headbutted Zimnock in the face during an interview. Um, then there's another clip of Zimnock after a fight. He is shouting back and forth with Spilka. Spilka's in the crowd, you know, talking shit to him. So that's a fight that I've been talking about for the last year. I thought that should have been Spilka's comeback fight and not the Adam Konowski fight. I thought the Zimnock fight should have been his comeback fight. But Zimnock and Spilka, they have both dropped their last fights. Uh, Spilka lost to Konowski, the undefeated uh, Polish kid. And then um, Zimnock just lost his fight to Joey Abel. All right. And Zimnock, before that, he had came back and he revenged Mike Malo. The Mike Malo loss, he avenged that loss. And he just dropped this one to Joey Abel. So Zimnock and Spilka, to me, is still it's still a good scrap. You know what I mean? It's kind of uh, under the radar type of fight out there in Poland. I think uh, a lot of those fans will get behind that fight. But I still like the fight, though. You know, but I'll leave this uh, in the comment section for you guys. I'll leave the actual article from Ring Polska and then you can translate it if you want or whatever you want to do with it, man. But let me know what you think in the comment section about Arthur Spilka. Um, I'm out.